This is a pseudocode that describes the web crawler task. If you go to a particular web page, crawler will visit links that in the web page. And if it want to update, do updation. index index contains copy of all the web pages that the web crawler finds every time if it wants update changes it use special software to find matches to search in an index and rank it based on the relevance to do all the above actions need some information to be stored in the database. Simply contains copy of all the web pages that the crawler finds. Indexing is based on content of the document that means body of the document not based on the title of the document. we cannot index web crawler cannot index images audio and video clips postscripts files etc even they are retrieved by mistake they are ignored during index suppose a web page has an image or audio video clips no need to follow that links because no such links to that links only thing is you can download that images or whatever the audios or videos so they are ignoring during index web crawler design www or world wide web has a dynamic structure and it is decentralized anyone can add contents to the web page no one is central control the design of the world wide web anyone can access internet add contents to that you can create web servers web pages uh, you can create hyperlinks to other pages no one can stop doing this if we think worldwide web as a graph every time it change some nodes added removed or deleted updated that's why we are calling World Wide Web as a dynamic structure. So the design implication at that point, discovering new documents and keeping the database updated is very important. If you cannot do it in a good way, the search engine cannot be much good. architecture of the web crawler search engine trying to build up index taking help of the agents agents will use in the library to search the internet but you are in the query processing mode the search engine will build in the database so the query server will be query in the database there is two different mode of operations here 
first one is while the index is created and the second one is index is already in the database user has typed some query and queries are retrieved by matching again the indexes from the database search engine deciding which new documents to explore and initiating the processes of their retrieval database store the document metadata full text index and hyperlinks between documents the database you can store some information about the documents called document metadata it can also contain keywords full text index are text based keywords and hyperlinks between documents agents retrieving the documents from the web under the control of search engine the agents are responsible for retrieving the documents from the web under the control of the search engine that means agent is a tool running under the search engine query server query server handles the query processing service a library this is not a separate software this is a standard library called cern www library this library used by the agents to access several different kinds of contents using different kind of protocols such as information of http ftp image documents protocols the web crawler has basically two kinds of searching while it create the index and while it responds to a user's query that means real time search mode <laughs> 